Excuse me, ma'am. I'm a man. Oh, I'm sorry. You look like a girl from behind. I don't like what you did there. <laughs> Alrighty. That's the first time we've actually gotten a kill on this. Yeah, we've actually. The story actually ended with what it was supposed to. We're on episode four. Well, guys, we're back. We're playing again. And uh, we're going to start a new hope. Am I going to still provide exposition? I mean, obviously. obviously. Well, since you know it so well. The only reason you're doing it is because you know this game better than anyone else. You know the story Star Wars better than anyone else. An original shot of the stars. They never did that in any of the other movies. <laughs> What's the name of that ship? Uh, it's something cruiser. It's like the Corvellian cruiser. What's the name of the ship that we're flying under? Or that's flying over us? It's just an Imperial ship. There you go. What do they call them, though? Star Destroyers. There you go. Is that what they're called? I believe so. Alright. This is a thrilling battle. Yeah, this is intense. Oh. Oh, God. I, I'm gonna be honest with you, Parker. I hate C-3PO. Really? I think he's one of the most annoying characters in the movie I've ever seen. Worse than Jar Jar Binks? Uh, significantly worse. Interesting. And the uh, new Battlefront, which you've played. Yes. You know, if you have to, if you leave the menu, You're just like running, just running for more than six seconds, how he and R two appear. That can happen. That's not the only thing that ever happens. I purposely go into like my uh, systems menu just to avoid that. Really? I hate I hate hearing his voice that much. I, uh... More often than that, I usually get the one that's like the walker walking through the screen. And, uh, some like little, like, car type thing is like driving around what next to it. What is wrong with my jump? Your guy panics every time he God, jumps. God, he's not going that high. No! <laughs> Give me down! Alright. Ah. Uh. So I went to a concert last night, Jake. My voice is a little shot when I try and yell. Who'd you see? Saw a band called The Wonder Years. Did you cry the entire time? I did not cry the entire time. Thank you for asking. It was a cool show and I liked it, but I did not cry. I I actually thought about you. They played like one of their sad slow songs and I was like, if I were to cry right now, Jake would never let me live it down, so I can't cry. And did I didn't. You, did you think it would be, oh. Did you think of it because my life is sad? What? Did you think of this, me during the slow sad song because my life is sad? No, I thought of you, you because you make fun of me constantly for crying. Nice. Nice hair. Looks really different. I want a hat, not hair. Oh yeah! So I guess I turned into a guy. Guess you've developed alopecia because all of your hair is gone. Alopecia? Alopecia. Not familiar. It's a it. disorder where you lose all your hair. I mean, kind of context clues, I suppose. Could have figured that out. Yep. I'm Captain Antilles, Captain Panaka's younger brother. Yeah. I texted you earlier this week uh, the sad fact about Captain Panaka. Which is what? Turns out to be less than. Uh, turns out to be a less than. Reputable no character? Noble character towards the end of the series. Do you know what he does? Because you said he. You texted us and said. Why like, are you building so much faster than I am? Because I, I had a power up. Oh, okay. Because you texted us and said, like, hey, turns out Panaka turns evil later in the later in the series, but what, what does he end up doing? Did you, uh, did you read he into just, that? He's friends with the Emperor, I guess. He just like, he's just, like, vibing with the Emperor? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, he apparently becomes, like, a governor of some country or something. Okay. Of some planet. I Probably know. a planet, yeah. Yeah, it seems more likely. That's interesting. I didn't know that. Yeah. I'm sorry, I'm sorry you had to learn that, that sad fact, though. That's all right. Take that, Darth Vader. Yeah. You could easily have killed us like you probably have millions of other people, but why would you do that when we can shoot bombs next to you? He's almost as tough in this as he is in Battlefront. He's almost as tough in this as he is in Episode 4 when him and Obi-Wan have the least thrilling lightsaber duel in the entire series. I've said I said it. I've never understood this. What is this grape thing? This grape This block. Uh-oh. I don't know. Okay. I've never noticed that. So I thought this was kind of interesting. You know how, like, Boba Fett is, like, uh, Darth Vader's, like, main boy? 
He's a, he's a homie for sure. They are. I don't know if he'd say, if it's a main boy, but he's definitely a homie. Can you would you say the equivalent like Darth Vader is like the vice president? Yeah, he's second in command for sure. Can you imagine if to do his bidding, Joe Biden hired Dog the Bounty Hunter to do his work? Dog the Bounty Hunter. I mean, how often is Joe Biden sending out like the work that Darth Vader gives Boba Fett? Like Joe Biden's not just running around being like, "Hey, Go fucking kill this guy for me. I don't know. The, the, honestly, if you read into the government, it's frightening how much they hide from you. <laughs> it's really scary. Aliens exist. Do you think aliens are real, Jake? I do. You do? I do. Someone once said... Do you think... More importantly, do you think we've made contact with aliens? Uh-oh. Oh, You're sad. <laughs> Remember that the movies, whenever the uh, guy gets ripped into seven different pieces? We gotta do this one, too. Oh. I don't think we have to, but this one gives us um, shit. What was I gonna say? Someone once said about aliens, what we know about space and haven't seen, it'd be the equivalent of going into the Pacific Ocean with like a med you know, like medicine cups that like come on yeah. Tylenol. With one of those, dipping it in the water, not catching a fish, and saying, I guess there's nothing in here. That's an interesting thought. Do you think we've made contact with aliens? Though? Do you think we're true Jedi? We are true oh, well, I know we're true Jedi. The government can't right. hide that from me. <laughs> you you'd be surprised what they'll try. <laughs> Do I think we've made contact? Yeah. I, I don't know. I wouldn't be surprised, but I'm not like. You don't like. You're not like convinced that like. We, I know. I swear they probably have. I take things at pretty face value, you know. If they say no, I'm not gonna start some conspiracy theory about it. I, have you have you met aliens? No, we haven't. There's a conspiracy theory. I mean, I I think 9/11 was a horrible terrorist attack. What do we have here? Gonna download some songs. Yeah, it's actually her mixtape. She's trying to give it to R2. It's Fway. Is that the end of the level already? Uh, we're nearing the end of the level, oh but I don't think God. that is. Why the do level. I always end up being one of the droids? Can you kill me? Um, I think 9 11 was a horrible terrorist attack where people lost their lives. I think it's somewhat disrespectful to say that it was a government thing. Yeah. We won't get this deep into it. We won't, we won't get this deep early on, though. <laughs> How did I, why am I not? It would make more sense if I was the droid because my character left. Well, you're player one, so you get preference. I guess, but still. I'll just hang out over here. Fuck. What's the button? Oh, I think it's X. Yeah, it's saying that. How sad is he? I'm sorry, are you sad right now? I didn't realize I was on the couch with someone who was sad right now. I'm doing fine. Perf. Please tell me I can beat him. I think you can, yeah. Okay. God bless you, rebel friend. You ready to go? I gotta wait for... Get over here, C-3PO. So, Parker, what do you think of the new Battlefront? I really, really like the new Battlefront. I think it looks really cool. I think it... It looks amazing. I think it plays really well. Uh, there you go. You got us. You, you progressed us, even though no one else had gone through yet. I did. I think it looks amazing. I think it plays really well. The maps are f fucking crazy looking, like, in a good way. I, I really like it. What do you think of it? They're crazy looking in a bad way. It, I really like the game. I think it looks great. The maps suck. Oh, uh, what do I think of the game? It's pretty good. Man, was in a bathing suit. Um... I wish there was some variation in the guns you can use, but that's all right. I mean, they have stat variation. As I told you earlier today, I wish there was like a sniping class, a yeah, an engineer class. Yeah, they definitely made it more like modern multiplayer mode instead of like how the original Battlefronts were. I don't know if we can go in there because you may need a force character, but uh, one of these has a uh, mini kit. No, it has a bunch of or stormtroopers in like a hot tub wearing speedos. Well, this looks depressing. Probably have to get this one yeah. too. There they are. Well, isn't that just silly? They don't. They don't seem to give a. Yeah, they really are. I hate that word. A crap? 
crap. I absolutely hate that word. Why is that? I just don't like it. I feel like... I feel like every person in the world has, like, that one word that they just, like, despise. Oh, mine's not crap. Mine's what is it? Fester. See, I don't have any words that, like, I don't like. I'm sure you like, do. Like, I, don't, I just don't care. Like, it's a word. Oh, my God. Jeez, Lois. I remember these levels are a lot longer than the first three episodes. Oh, yeah. And we out. All right. We're just going to leave behind the rebels, I guess. That's fine. Hey, we could just shoot two. We could just shoot one shot and end the series right here. No, it's just some droids. Have you heard that there, before? Well, it's like there's no life form on it. They well, didn't. They didn't know the droids were there. Have you heard that before? What? That if they had shot that down, the movies would. Yeah, it's exist? like the, it's a galactic battleship. Like, is one shot really that big of a deal? You look what you could have prevented. Well, I'm. I want to say this could be wrong. I there was they scanned and there was no life form on it. So I think they thought that it was like a like a misfire, like it just kind of shot out on its own. Shooting it doesn't seem like it'd have been that big of a deal. I mean, I guess not, but at the same time, you also it's just as unlikely that one escape pod meant that two droids were gonna go find someone who was the next Jedi Master type person who was then gonna kill everyone that was in the Sith. It also, seems true. like a pretty unlikely scenario. No, that's true. Princess Leia is quite good in Battlefront. Yeah, she is. She can pop shields for days. And you get, like, little helpers that, like, run around and help you out and shit. I don't know if you noticed this. Look next time we come to that character screen. Who we okay. have selected. Okay. Actually, we'll do it right now. I don't know. I, I don't remember a whole lot of this game. The second episode's... I think they were pretty tedious, if I'm not wrong. What, like 4, 5, and 6? Yeah. I remember not liking the beginning of uh, episode 4's story. Like, that level's whatever. Look, look at all these characters. We have all the story characters. <laughs> and then Django Fett, Fett and a pit droid. And of course, pit droid. <laughs> the two greatest characters in the series. Besides R... R4, P17. This is a love story right here. Okay. I fly solo. I, I fly Han. Do you get it? No. Okay. Who's Han Solo? A New Hope. Chapter 2. Through the Jungland Wastes. Darth Vader searches... This is the level I remember being, like, much longer than it really needed to be. Because I think for half the time, one of us has to be the droid. No, I'm pretty sure one of us is Luke and one of us is Ben. Or maybe we pick him up later. And someone has to be a droid for a little bit. Fun fact, did you know that where, uh... In episode 2, when Anakin comes back to Tatooine, and he's like, where's my mom? And then he's like, oh, the... Uh, wait, wait, wait. He goes back to Tatooine? Yeah, in episode 2. Okay. And he's like, where's my mom? I wanna... I, wanna, I love this scene. I wanna say what's up to her. Okay, continue. He's like, I want to say what's up to my mom. Uh, his old slave owner's like, oh yeah, I sold her. And he goes to whoever he sold her to. And uh, it's like a family. Yeah. And that family lives in the house that Luke lives in in the beginning of episode four. Yeah. And the guy who like his mom got sold to had a kid. And that kid was uh, Lars, who becomes like Luke's like quote-unquote uncle Lars. Or Uncle Owen, I'm sorry. Lars was uh, the the older man's name. Crazy. Owen was the... It's foreshadowing. See, if anything, you have the better character. You have force power. I will gladly lightsaber. switch with you. No, I, I want to be... I want to... No, fuck it. I want to be Luke. Come back. I want to be Luke. I want to be Luke. Switch with me. You're always the shooter, and I'm always... Because you like the Jedi better. I do like the Jedi better, but now I want to switch it up. I want to shake it up Chicago. Okay. Zendaya? Zendaya and what was the other bitch? I, Bella Thorne. That was way past my time on Disney Channel. My little brother watched it, so... I swear to God I didn't watch it. It was my little brother. Yeah. I had a little brother, so I saw it all the time. Oh, yeah. If they released Ow. a DVD... Or... Jeez, I guess not even a DVD. If on Netflix they released every single DCOM, would you at least watch one? 
Yeah. I, I mean, I watched Emperor's New... Because, like... That's not a DCOM. Uh, it's not a DCOM, but I'm saying, like, old kids' movies are, like, the greatest thing for Netflix because it's, like... If you have a bunch of people and no one can decide what to watch, it's like, fuck it, we'll just put on, like, Emperor's New Groove and, like, hang out. So I feel like if they put on all the, the Disney Channel movies, those would also, like, fit that category of, like, we don't know what we actually want to watch, so we're just going to put this on and vibe. Yeah? Yeah. Do you not agree? Do you think I'm stupid for saying this? No, no I, agree. I you, agree. You think I'm stupid? I... I get it. I'm glad. You're sad. Okay. Boy, those guys are out of range. If only we had a gun of some sort. If only you could block them back at them like you can. Sitting here blocking. You're supposed to hit X right before it hits you. Look there at that. Go. Goes right back at him. Crazy. Okay, buddy. There you go. I wanted you to learn something, though. I, I did. Well, looks then, it was like, for not. Looks like... The students becoming the teacher. Exactly. Did you and Cooper ever play games together? Uh, okay, that's depressing. We played, we played sports games and stuff. But we never really played. We played Mario Party together. This is a big one between my brother and I. This was. It was. My little brother was always more into sports than video video games. That's where it went wrong. Yeah. We we played a sport today, Jake. We did. We played baseball today. We played baseball today, and how, that went well. How was I? You batting was the greatest thing ever. I don't know why. I was not going to get, you know, I'm never going to get a home run if I don't get people to first or second base. <laughs> Boy, if you can't hit a grounder right to the shortstop. <laughs> That's usually to where they put their worst player, to be fair. Exactly. Oh, I remember this level. Yeah, I, I this is my least favorite level in the game. This, I don't this know. level there's takes a, like 45 there's a minutes. Few. Yay. When are we gonna start a speed run? I wonder if you like if anyone ever has speed run a Lego I'm game. I'm sure. Alright. You're gonna have to force that Kush. Uh you may or may not know. Next week is Thanksgiving. We'll be going home. I I did know that actually. Christian and I have a uh, let's play plan. Well, do you? Yeah, we do. What let's play? We are going. Well, it's not much of a let's play. We're gonna make a few episodes of something. Of what? We're gonna play um, one of our favorite shared games together, Resident Evil Four. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Yeah, it'll be a fun time. I haven't done a let's play with Christian since Crash. Yeah, that's that's probably the unlikeliest of pairs is you and Christian. I would completely disagree. Who who is me and Gage? I guess you two alone being in a video is less likely, but I feel like it's more likely that me you and Gage will do a let's play than it is for you and Christian to do a let's play. Just because Gage lives in Orlando and Christian. Well, just because don't. I don't like Gage. Yeah, exactly. Gage, we actually you're out of here, I said. I, I hate for you to find out this way. I've made but. this comparison before. It's like they're the Avengers in New York City. I guess I can call these. And we're the Avengers in L.A. Except for the fact that Gage is also in New York City. Well, he he, re when was he, last goes, time he goes on frequent when business was it, trips. When was the last time you made a video with Gage? Crash? Yeah. Oh, there you go. <laughs> there you go. You and I have tried to make videos a few... Okay, you know, the droids getting pushed thing, that's really starting to irk me. Uh, this guy's a fuckboy in a cool was way. Was there anything... Is that it? Did we just fucking... Push all that shit for no for not. That's fine. Oh. Okay. Oh, I want to build this does something. Nope. Just another droid for you to push. I think actually the reviewers reviewers of this game said there was not enough droid pushing. Well, there wasn't in episode one, two, and three, so they added more in four, five, and six. Jeez. What's this? Okay. No. No. Ah. 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 What's the goal here? Probably push. Nope, that's a blue stud. Um, probably want to push it onto R two. All right. Jeez, we need a lot of studs for this level. Burn this fucker. 
Oh. Never mind the guy with the lightsaber or the pistol. The robot trying to open the elevator door is a much bigger threat. What do you think of Obi-Wan oh. in episode 4? Uh, he's cool. His lightsaber battles less than stellar for sure. Were any of the lightsaber battles good in the old ones? Yeah, uh, they got better for sure. Uh, uh, okay. Good to know. Okay. Um, <laughs> in episode four, it was a pretty lackluster fight, but five and six had some pretty cool fights. I was bored in class nope. one day. Stop, stop, stop. Why am I stopping? We need to get the thing over. No, no, no. It was in the right spot. No. This was open. No, we need it like this. It was in the right spot. Trust me. Why do we need it like that? Watch. Oh, yeah. You need to have See? it pointed at what it... Okay. Um. When I was... I was bored in class one day. Right. And so... Okay. Thank God. I was born in class, so I put on a video on YouTube, which was a compilation of every lightsaber Here battle in okay, all the Star Wars movies. And turns out it's an hour and ten minute long video, for starters. Wow. I would take a guess that the bulk of the video took place in episode three. Uh, yeah, of, of episode one, two, and three took up, it was like an hour and ten minutes. Like 40 minutes at least, 45 probably, was all episode 1, 2, and 3. And then the last like 20 minutes was episode 4, 5, and 6. Yeah. But, uh. Boy, this is a. This, this is the level that just keeps on giving. It's the level for sure. Go ahead, though. But yeah, it was. For? It was. Because episode 3, the last lightsaber fight, is, uh. Yoda and Sidious? No, it's well, that's, Mustafar. Yeah, that's what's happening, like, at the same time. But, like, the way the video ordered it was... Uh, the last one was Obi-Wan and Anakin, which is, like, this intense fucking, like... Like, crazy choreography on a desert... Or on, a, like, a lava planet. And, like, they're, they're running all over shit and, like, jumping on platforms and almost burning in lava. And then it hard cuts to Obi-Wan fighting Darth Vader in Episode Four, And it was, like... The most jarring, lackluster fight of all time. Don't they like swing four times and that's that? It's it's pretty slow for sure. Yeah, we wanted to put up much of a fight. It, granted, neither did Darth Vader, but still. He was just there to have some fun. He was just he was just vibing. You know what we're on right now? What are we on? This is the hero's journey. Why is that? It's just the classic template. <laughs> This is the originator of the hero's journey, as Gage points out. Okay, See and now, you know. now, now we're now we're being traitors. I'm sorry. I saved you just so I could kill you myself. All right. It's actually the biggest plot twist is that Obi Wan's uh, a villain, and then Anakin's the good, or Darth Vader's the good guy, and he saves Luke from Obi Wan's clutches. So, why is it that every single, like, good character has an American accent and every single bad character is British? That's not true. Okay. Obi-Wan is... In the, new, in the old movies. But still... In I'm... the new movies, everyone has an accent. What do you mean? No. No, in episode 1, 2, and 3. Everyone has an accent. Not true. Anakin doesn't have an accent. Okay, he's the exception. The I don't think Padme has an accent. Well, she's a good character. And the, Anakin's a good character. You just proved my point. Well, no. Anakin's the most okay, evil okay, character. Okay, okay. Let's talk the old ones. Four, five, and six? Yes. So wait, you're saying good guys have accents Amer and bad guys don't? Good guys have American accents. Okay. Bad guys have British. I mean, I've never really looked into that, so okay. I... Well, this was just a lackluster conversation. I'm not so saying that you're wrong. I'm just saying I've never put thought oh. into that. That's an interesting observation. Why did I think I was Luke? Can I just hop in with you? All right, let's go. Squad goals. It's been fun. So, how... Can we, we can just leave the droids? Or are they supposed to, like, hop in with us? Maybe we can just, you know... 
run them over and in their lives. Oh, here's this. This level, it, ugh. What's the most unpleasant level you've ever played in a game? In a video game? Yeah, a video game. Um, I, I didn't see a level right here. Oh my god. The uh, the only level I've ever gotten genuinely angry with is uh, in Modern Warfare here, 2 Parker. Veteran Mode. The favela. The favela level. You threw your controller. I threw my controller. It's the only time I've ever gotten angry enough to like throw something in a video game. And I threw my controller and broke it. And I immediately regretted every decision I'd made up to that point. I thought... Oh, never mind. You thought what? No, I thought that his, like, family was dead at this point. Nah. I have a lightsaber. Oh, no. I have a cup. No. No. She pulls out a dildo. That'd be inappropriate. Hey, another lightsaber that I was carrying the entire time. Thank God. Now no one can rebuild him and he's useless. He wouldn't do much for me anyway. Do we can squeeze out this last part or do we want to cut it there? No, nah, we should probably cut it there. We're at like 25 minutes. Dang. Alright, well. Join us next time when we continue through the most exciting episode of Star Wars ever. Without question.